Welcome to Deep Thought. Moments of peace. You know what? This past weekend, it was a Friday. I got in my car to do something. I didn't have any. I had all my videos done for the week, uh, all my projects. And it was a moment of peace. It was a moment of peace. Like it's like, damn, I can do anything in this. And it was a it was a profound peace. It was like, wow, everything's going all right. Yeah. Um like I was able I'm able to all bills are paid. I have control over how I'm living. I'm like, you know, this is a good thing. <laughs> This is a good thing. It's like it was like nothing. It was nothing to stress me out over. Nothing. I have I have nothing to really stress me. Like I have to I have to make up something to say I'm stressed. I was like, well, maybe the stress. Like, well, no, it's really not a stress. You know, my biggest. It's not even a stress. I think the biggest thing I might be I might have a sales goal and I might get a little stress making it, but it's a good stress. Because it keeps me going. But even then, I could say, yeah, I'm good. <laughs> and I'm still all right. I'm like, wow. I don't have to think about how I'm going to make money for the next, like, rent's covered well into 2020. In fact, it's covered for the rest of my lease. And it starts in July. I'm, you know, it's actually covered for the whole year. <laughs> like, wow, this is this is powerful. So there's there's not that stress there. It's nothing to like really worry about. Bills cover everything for a very long time. Not for the whole year, but a very long time. I'm just like, wow. And that's not really the goal. And I'm going I'm to get into that in a video, a podcast later this week. I'm going to get into that about uh, the happiness part. Because it wasn't so much as happiness. But it was so much as just sitting here thinking, wow, this there's nothing to stress me over. I'm just like totally comfortable. I can go have fun, can think about new things. Like one thing, when you in a when you have those moments of peace, that's when you can start seeing stuff. Because one of the things that stops someone from really thinking is they stressed out over little things. It's not even little things, it's major things. Like you get some people if like, for example, I just saw a report that said uh, many people can't afford the basics, maybe half of all Americans. It was something like that, but it was very high. I don't have it right in front of me. And y'all know when I do this, it's stream of consciousness. So um, other other videos, I might actually have some notes. I usually just go off a title here. But I was just like, wow. That got to be stressful. Like, you got you to, gotta, like, scramble to get to pay for stuff how can you be at peace that's stress or you know if you if that car hits a bump or there's an accident you don't have the money to get it fixed even if you have insurance because of deductibles you imagine that like uh they wouldn't have it and i mean people might say well is this more for your business channel no because everything is related because economic your economics is going to affect your state of peace how can you be at peace and you know you got a cutoff notice and if you married or you living with somebody, how y'all going to have good sex if you worried about the cutoff notice <laughs> or you worry about the lights going out? I mean, that's the one thing. It's like we live in a society now where most of our, uh, most of our needs go, can only be met through money, our material needs anyway. And it affects everything else because... You know, when things aren't there or you don't have the money or you got to save for something, that's stressful. Or even just having the freedom to go out and, I don't know, go to an expensive restaurant. I mean, if I was stupid enough, I could drop a thousand at a restaurant without missing it. And, and this ain't to brag on me, but it gives you a perspective on a lot of what people's going on. I mean, it's hard. You can always tell them, oh, yeah, the highest expression of religion, uh, any religion is being at peace, being state of grace or whatever. But that's hard to do. <laughs> that's hard to do if you if your stomach's rumbling involuntarily. Like I've been intermittent fasting, so it's very voluntary. But if I would just want to be a glutton, I shoot like, big breakfast, big lunch, big dinner. Of course, my my, my personal trader would be very happy about that because I'll be giving I'll be giving her a lot of work. <laughs> 
But, you know, once you, once you have everything done, just getting back to the peace thing, it's, it's a very powerful, like, you're just sitting there, you're just chilling. It's like, wow. Wow, you you can just sit there. It's like, man, ain't it's nothing to stress me out. Unless you choose to. Shoot, even your mates. Even even your mates, they're like because if they are less, they are they are a lot peaceful when you're peaceful. So they generally peaceful. And even if somebody something comes along like another person to try to stress you out, you usually like, eh, I don't have to deal with you. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Bye, boo. <laughs> But it's powerful. And that's, you know what, that's the thing to strive for. That's the thing to strive for. Understanding that it's not even so much as saying make money. You want to make money. but And you don't want to stress yourself out to do it. But just to savor those moments. Because it's tough. It's tough. It's tough because people will try to bring stress into your lives. They'll try to bring drama into your lives. Ironically, sometimes even if you're just trying to be peaceful, they'll try to bring drama. But when you have those moments, you just, like you have a, like for those who are listening, you ever have those moments, you just so at peace, you just want to bust out laughing. Like I do that a lot. People don't realize that. I know I got this serious thumbnail and uh, sometimes I'll be real serious or I'm cursing or I'm doing something, but I actually laugh a lot because I'm just like, man, this is... This is so chill. Like, like just, you know, I could drive to a car lot and look at something. Or I could just say, you know what? I don't have to go any place. I can just sit on my couch and chill on my plush couch. It's very plush. For an inexpensive couch, it's very plush. And I can just sit there and chill. I don't have to do anything. And those moments of peace. Um, and, I, I, you know... I think everybody needs to have that. Even in, even if they don't have the money, even if they got a bunch of stuff, just find a way to be at peace. Put on that music. You know, put a, put on that music from Soundscapes. People always ask me what I have on. I just put it on. I never know. What I got on now, though, is... Uh, uh, that's, too much, that's too much stuff to read. It's like a combination. I'm like, I don't feel like reading that. Um... But it's it's peaceful. You know, sit there, light some incense, meditate. In fact, I'm going to talk about meditation in my next one, not the way people would expect it, though. But you just want to you wanna find those moments of peace. They are so priceless. They are. They really are. You can't, you can't put a price on them. You cannot put a, a price on it. Because, as I said about stress, that's really what... But stress really makes people sick. It really, because if you're stressed and you're worried, I mean, that's actually having an effect on your hormones. You know, and your endorphins. You're not feeling good. You're just like, boom. In fact, you can look at somebody. You can halfway look at somebody and tell if they're stressed. You can you can look at somebody, and they ain't gonna say, hey, "Look, let me let me be honest with y'all." I ain't, look. I ain't, don't, don't look at Ron and say I'm always, I, that's why I say moments of peace. <laughs> it's like, cause there's a, I, one of my weaknesses is I tend to be a workaholic. So uh, by nature, I'm always putting some stress on myself. And, I'm, and I say on myself, but now I'm like, then it's like when you get those moments of peace, you really recognize it. You're just like, wait a minute, I can just chill out. I don't have to do anything. You know, in another way, you could have moments of peace. Don't, don't, unless it's some time specific that deals with somebody else's time. Do things, do things at your own pace. Like I say, if you if you're dealing with somebody else's, if what you're doing affects somebody else, boom. Because even now, when I'm recording this, usually I would be at the gym at this time, but I'm like, you know, what I'm go later. I don't know, nobody. I don't have to be there for anybody. So. Yeah, moments of peace. That's 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 what you want to like strive for. This is very beautiful. So anyway, something to think about. Peace and blessings. <laughs>